फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल आम आशी अदानी एंड वेलकम टू अ न्यू एपिसोड ऑफ बाय और बाय लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड So I've got about 15 products right here with me, and we are going to quickly go through them. These are products I've completed in the past two or three months, and um, let's dive in. So first, we've got the Faith and Patience Nourish Niacinamide Avocado Oil and Vitamin E Face Wash. It is a good face wash. It smells very strongly of roses. So if you're someone who is against that, you might not enjoy this. Uh, it's a nice hydrating face wash. It's a foaming face wash. It's not going to strip your skin of its natural oils. Did it do anything magical to my face? No, not really. It's a normal face wash and i think it's quite affordable as well so if you're looking for like a no fuss face wash you can try it out if you're not you can skip it next we've got another cleanser this one's from biosense uh, it's a squalene amino aloe gentle cleanser this is a korean brand and uh, it took me a while to get through this because a little product goes a very long way with this face wash it's supposed to hydrate your skin it's supposed to nourish your skin it's also supposed to uh, remove like less makeup not a full glam but being the person that i am i never just use this to remove my makeup i always double cleanse this is actually quite pricey so i would skip this because not like it did something magical to my face that i can even recall like in the last month and a half that i haven't used this so yeah it just cleanses your skin without over drying and that's what it claims to do it doesn't claim to do anything else either so i think the benefits of this can be achieved at a lower cost so i would i would skip this one as well next we've got a toner this is a neo gen dermology toner now this again is a korean brand i don't know why we have so many korean skincare uh products happening but we just do it's a microbio ferment complex it's supposed to make your skin brighter hydrated softer and honestly it did do it like there is um this toner worked very beautifully on my skin it didn't make me go oh wow like with brighter skin but it definitely made my skin very hydrated and i feel like when i was using this my other products absorbed better into my skin as well but again this is quite pricey and the benefits that i felt can be achieved at a lower cost uh with a plum toner or a simple toner but if you're looking for like a korean bougie uh toner i would recommend this one because it did everything that it claims to do Next we've got the Clinique even better radical spot corrector serum. Now I um finished using the serum. Uh I used to use this in the day every day. Uh this was not my night serum and it didn't do anything for me. Like to cut the shit short, it did nothing for my skin. I don't think it reduced any spots or anything of that sort. It felt nice on the skin. It did not make my skin feel oily. It made my skin look very glowy also throughout the day, but I genuinely don't think it reduced spots for me. They don't have any proven ingredients which could be exfoliating to reduce the um appearance of dark spots they just say they have some equalizer technology and i honestly don't know much about it so i wouldn't comment on that but as a serum that i have completed using no it did not help me reduce my dark spots next we've got another serum that did not work for me this is the mac hyperreal serumizer it's a skin balancing hydration serum and it did hydrate my skin yes but this got over so quickly you guys so quickly like i was upset at how quickly this has gotten over and it is a pricey product so why is it getting over so quickly very disappointed it's a normal hyaluronic type serum it does have hyaluronic acid ceramides niacinamide and japanese peony extract all good ingredients nothing wrong with it nothing wrong with how the serum performed as well but i just felt like it's very pricey for something that gets over this quickly and only hydrates the skin i didn't see any renewing benefits i didn't feel like my skin barrier was more repaired or anything of that sort it was just like a normal serum to put over my retinol sort of a thing so would not recommend you getting this one Next we've got another Korean serum. This is the brand G9 Skin. I got this from Nykaa. Uh it's their Super B Barrier serum. It's got vitamin B5, hyaluronic acid and microbiome. This serum 
uh, again like the max serum i was just pairing it with my active so that it could soothe my skin pretty much uh, this one did last me for a while it's like a nice blue serum it did good stuff for my skin i felt like my skin was definitely a lot more hydrated and it looked healthier and plumper the next day every time i used this serum but again this is a very pricey product but if you're looking for a nice hyaluronic acid serum which can repair your skin's barrier definitely check this one out if not then any l'oreal hyaluronic acid serum also could do the job of this next we've got the wishful pillow gasm cherry glow sleeping mask and oh my god has it taken me months to finish this this you just need like the tiniest amount of this product and that's it and it's a big big jar i think it's taken me you also get a spatula with it and it's taken me about 6 months or more to complete this so it does last you a while it does uh wake you up with the softest plumpest skin ever i absolutely love this product it's very expensive as well but i feel like this will last you for so long that it will be worth the money plus if you are just looking for a mask that will hydrate your skin overnight i would highly highly recommend this one you can even use it as a face mask and then wash it with water after 15 minutes before your makeup so there are lots of ways to use this and i think it's totally worth the money and the hype next we've got the nux anti dark spot and anti aging hand cream now this hand cream costs 2900 rupees and nux is a brand it's a french brand that everybody knows and loves and all the products are very hyped but sad to tell you that it did nothing for me it did absolutely nothing for my hands sure it's a nice hand cream but it's definitely not doing any anti aging anti spots nothing for my hands and um, again this lasted me like a good 3 4 months you just need a little product but save your money do not get this one it is ridiculously expensive for nothing next we've got the aveda scalp solutions shampoo i love this okay this is a very very good shampoo if you are someone with oily scalp or dandruff or whatever issues that you feel you have with scalp definitely try the shampoo out they also have a scalp solutions um scalp exfoliator and the conditioner skip it don't get it the conditioner i have finished i don't have here with me for some reason but um uh, it's a very lightweight conditioner and it is something you can use on like from your scalp to the ends but i don't recommend it because it's a very lightweight conditioner i need something that's very heavy on my um uh, hair and the scalp exfoliator was nice as well but the shampoo you guys i have never felt this strongly about a shampoo ever in my life it is pricey yes but it's totally worth it it's going to last you for like a two, a good month and a half two months it made my hair so shiny it made my hair lightweight it like i felt like all the stress from my scalp was releasing every time i use this product and i will 100% go back to this one every time i feel like i have scalp issues highly highly recommend saving up for this shampoo and then we have a hair fail this is the olaplex number no. 4 clean volume detox dry shampoo now i specially got this one from london like i called for it from london because it had not released in india at the time now you can get it in india and it absorbs oil very less it volumizes not really it gives your hair that thick feeling like your fingers will get stuck in your hair uh it does not refresh it has a very peculiar smell that i don't like and it will keep your hair fresh for like an hour it's not strong like your batiste and all you can put it in your hair and you can go another day and a half with your hair without washing them but this one just doesn't cut it for me yeah ex like it's over <laughs> extremely disappointed uh in this product i genuinely don't like it then we've got some wish care hair growth concentrate serums now i finished three of these because as you know i go very heavy handed with these i think in the last video i had shown you two and i finished those and now i have three new ones that i have completed i am seeing a reduction in hair fall with these i am still seeing very very few almost negligible baby hair still but i feel like it is working like finally i am seeing the results of it because it does say 90 days 
to see results and i've been using it long enough for that and definitely it has helped with hair fall so i quite like this product and would recommend the wish care hair growth serum but i would also recommend a lot of patience with it okay don't miss using it don't stop using it and use it consistently for a good 3 months to be able to see results because hair growth is honestly not a joke it's not as easy as skin care yeah i would recommend being patient with these as well then for hair we've got the moroccan oil treatment oil i have heard fabulous things about this product i got a mini to try out and it smells amazing it smells fabulous but does it do anything that my normal l'oreal extraordinary serum cannot no nothing like nothing i ever i used this my hair smelled good and that's about it it did tame flyaways but i was not impressed with the results where i would come back and be like oh my god my hair is still shining no nothing like that and it's a very pricey product so definitely skip over the then we've got the clinic moisture surge lip treatment absolutely absolutely love this product it has changed the lip game if you feel like nothing works on your chapped lips dry lips try this one it is worth the money it is worth the um saving up for angle you just put this at night before you go to sleep and like the last thing before you go to sleep once you apply this don't even drink water like just go to sleep and next morning when you're brushing your teeth and then you wipe your mouth like water will be on your mouth and then when you wipe it away with a napkin all the dead skin cells will come out and your lips will look so hydrated and plump it just makes your lips look amazing so highly highly recommend this one next we've got the sol de janeiro brazilian boom boom cream ah uh, what can i what can i say about this product that has not been sold already it's khali but the smell still lingers really really like it it's a nice lightweight moisturizer it smells really good but the fragrance doesn't last for over like 4 hours i would say 4 hours max and it's lightweight so it's not like deeply nourishing if you feel like oh my skin is really dry and maybe this will solve it no it won't it's a nice lightweight bougie feeling moisturizer uh it's not going to change your skin at all but it smells really nice and it feels very nice and lightweight on the skin so again this is a splurge yourself spoil yourself kind of product not something that i would be like this is going to do everything it's not and last we've got fragrance uh i don't think we've done fragrance on these episodes yet but we've got the estee lauder beautiful bell perfume it has taken me almost a year and a half year and a half to finish this i got this last year on my birthday my friends gifted it to me and it smells divine if it smells like you're made of money okay it smells like you're a woman in power i can't explain this every time i've worn this perfume people have asked me what perfume i'm wearing it's a head turner perfume it is a little pricey but like i have gucci and I've, every time i wear gucci nobody asks me what perfume i'm wearing but this one really makes head turn and i'm trying to squeeze every bit of it because it smells so luxurious and beautiful and i absolutely love this it's a great gifting option or if you're looking for your next signature scent definitely check it out uh try it out at an estee lauder or a sephora before you buy it online uh so to make sure you like the fragrance and that's about it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did then please make sure to like it subscribe to my channel comment below and let me know what product you're looking forward to trying i will see you guys next saturday bye